Because we are considering 
the static thread. What is the next case? Next case is your time varying thread. Time varying thread. So I am not going to write the sentences again. I am only going to write the formula. Concept already I have given here in case of static thread. So only I am going to represent the formula. In case of time varying thread, this potential Vr. It will be represented as Vr of T because it is time varying thread. So potential is going to vary with respect to time. This will be equals to same formula I am going to read. So integration rho v. You have seen this rho v I have uh, kept in a bracket. So the reason is what here it was a function of only space but here it will be a function of both space and time. So a uh, minor difference only I have changed the uh, format. Here I have kept this rho v in uh, bracket so that you can represent that it is a function of time also. Then dv divided by 4 pi epsilon 0 r. And you can mention here this rho v it is a function of x, y, z as well as time. Space as well as time. Your x, y, z is space and this is your time. Next, your magnetic vector potential. Vector A that will be given by mu 0 by 4 pi integration. Sorry students, here I have forgot to write. It will be your B. Then V and J. I am going to write here like this. Okay. Then dp, where j is a function of space as well as So this is, uh, this two are the cases of static field and time varying field. And mathematically we are representing the uh, electrostatic potential and the magnetic vector potential like this. But now what we are going to do, we will go for the retarded potential. So as I have already told, when there is a time delay, then we are going to have the retarded potential. Now see, using this formula, I am going to write the concept or I am going to represent the retarded potential. Now suppose you have a time delay. So if you are having a time delay, then if there is a time delay, you can take any factor. Any time factor you can take. So if there is a time delay by a factor of by a factor of tau, then I can write for T dash is equals to previous time was T. T minus tau. But T dash is what? T dash is your delay time. Delay time. Okay. Similarly, if we have a time delay, then naturally the position of the point is also going to be delayed. That is why new position, new position of point, new position of the point, that will be here the position I have taken initially R. So the new position will become R dash. And R dash will be equals to, this was your original one, there is some delay in position also. So let the delay factor be R. Okay, this R, this one is your delay. Delay position. Okay, so now using this two formula, I am going to write the final formula for the retarded potential. So, now, V, now mark one thing all of you, VR, here I have written VR of T, but as we are having a new position R dash, that is why it will be VR dash of again time, but the new time is what? T dash, so it will be T dash. This will be equals to, it is a formula term. Rho B dV divided by 4 pi epsilon 0 R. But R is going to be substituted by R dash. And what about this Rho B? Rho B will be the function of x, y, z and the time factor but it will be t dash the 
it is a new type. Similarly, coming to the magnetic vector potential, vector A, this one. So, vector of T dash, because here, this one is vector A I have written, but actually it should be your, um, because it is time very well, so mistakenly I have left this T. So, vector A of T, this one, but now this T will be substituted by T dash. This will be equals to, see this formula, mu 0 by 4 pi r dash integration of this is the form where j is a function of space as well as time but the time will be new time t dash and uh, students uh, here see I am extremely sorry mu 0 by 4 pi r I have left r by mistake here also mu 0 by 4 pi r it may confuse you but I am extremely sorry I left it mu 0 by 4 pi r here also mu 0 by 4 pi r so again I am repeating once again I am just summarizing what I did for the retarded potential first I took two cases static field and time varying field in the static field I have found the expression of uh, electrostatic potential or electric scalar potential that is V bar at the position R Next, I found the expression of magnetic vector potential. As we have the static field, that is why this rho v and vector g, they will be function of only space. Space is x, y, z. Then in case of time varying field, v r of t and vector a of t. Same formula, but what is the difference? Here rho v will be function of space as well as time and vector g will be function of space as well as time. Finally, when we are going to have a delay, that delay in time as well as position I am going to substitute in the formula of uh, electric scalar potential and magnetic vector potential. I am going to get this two. This is the concept of your retarded potential. Thank you.